Welcome Aquarius. This is Renee and welcome back. Aquarius, this is going to be your reading for the next 48 hours. So let's get into it. This is what you can expect. What's coming forward? What is going on Aquarius in the next 48 hours? Okay. So if this reading resonates, please like and subscribe. Hit that bell so that you don't miss any uploads. And if it doesn't resonate, take a look at your other placements. They may be resonating more with you at this time. Okay? So, what do we got for Aquarius? The next 48 hours, please. Okay, we have two. Wow, okay. Both sevens. Interesting. Okay, so we have the seven of action, which is the seven of wands. Okay? You're being called upon to claim your personal power. Feel confident as your angels will give you the strength to say no when it's the right thing to do for yourself. Mm -hmm. Your struggle may actually stem from an unresolved inner conflict rather than a conflict with others. Okay, so the Seven of Wands. We also have the Seven of Abundance. Okay, this is the seven of pentacles. So have patience. Sometimes a, a dream grows slowly. Don't worry. The hard work you've invested will bring about a bountiful harvest. This is a good time to prepare because things will soon move forward quickly. Use this time to rest and plan. Okay, so seven, seven. You know, something is going on here. So, um, take action in your situation. Okay. And we also have at the bottom creativity and abundance. So, it says, dear one, you're being called to action. You're ready to accomplish great things and truly come into the fullness of who you are. It's a time of great creativity, giving birth to beloved projects, and becoming a parent. Follow your passion so that abundance and prosperity manifest for you. Okay? So, yeah, this is card number three. So, this is the, the Empress. Yeah, this is the Empress. Hmm. Very interesting. So you, you're having that energy of the Empress. You're manifesting. You're very creative. You may be a good parent, but I feel like you're very attractive at this time. You People may be finding you more confident, more attractive, more appealing. You know, because you just had that vibe flowing from you Aquarius okay let's take a look at love let's see what's going on in Aquarius's love life the next 48 hours give me a message for Aquarius the next 48 hours please okay we have heartbroken wow so there may be some kind of situation that leaves you in doubt there may be some sort of situation that you are very doubtful for. You may be sad, uh, heartbroken, heartbroken over a situation. There may be some kind of separation that may be happening for you in the next 48 hours. Feeling kind of lost, kind of lonely. Okay. Um, we also have passion. So I don't feel like, I feel like you're kind of torn between two things here. Aquarius we have heartbroken and passion so I, I feel like you know there's something that's going to make you very sad or very emotional but there's also something that's going to make you feel very passionate very overwhelmed you know you are going to get out there and maybe have fun have some sort of excitement some kind of surprises surprises will be unfolding right um, so I feel like whatever this is that is leaving you heartbroken is not going to last very long because you have this passion here as well. Okay, 
So let's take a look at these energies. Uh, let's get a message from this for Aquarius. If this is a person, give me a message for their energy. Spirit, give me a message in their intentions. What would they like to say to Aquarius? Okay. I wish things could be different. Wow. My life is not as together as it seems. I hid who I really am from you. You know what, Aquarius? I feel like, you know, this energy that I'm getting, I feel like this is someone who may be keeping their feelings from you a secret. I feel like this is someone who really wants to approach you, but really doesn't have the courage to do it just yet. So many things remind me of you. Or this could be someone that you have let go of. Yeah, this could be someone that you're letting go of as well. I feel like you're leaving me behind. Okay. Very interesting. And we also have, I'm so attracted to you. Right? So and I feel like there's, there's a lot of messages here. So I feel like there's, there's someone, the energy that I'm getting, that there's someone who feels like you're leaving them behind. Like something is just not working out. Um, so they're kind of hiding themselves. They're hiding their feelings. They're, they don't want to show you their real emotions. So they're like blocking that energy so that you don't notice exactly how they're feeling. Exactly, you know, what's coming forward. Because they, they don't have it to, as together as it seems. I feel like this may be someone who may act on the outside like they have all the answers. Like everything is going really well. And everything is working out just as they plan. But deep inside... They're, they're very heartbroken. They're very sad. They're very hidden. Okay? I, I feel like there's, there's something that is keeping them from this passion. Okay? And this may be someone that is coming through with a past energy. This may be your energy coming through Aquarius. But I feel like... You know, there, there's something that's being held back. Some kind of true emotions, true feelings aren't being shown. All right? Handmade cards. See, these are handmade. But we're going to get some more energy. See what is coming through for this person. Get some more messages for Aquarius, please. What's coming through for Aquarius? What else does Aquarius need to know the next 48 hours? Okay. Okay, we have let it go. Okay, there's something that needs to be released. There's something that you need to let go of in order to have this abundance, have this action to be taken, okay, or to have this love come through, this passion. Okay, there's something that needs to be let go of. It may be past energy that you may need to let go of, but I'm really getting the indication that there's something that has to be released, okay? The outcome will be positive. So something is working out. Okay. Something will be positive. Just have faith in your situation. Have faith that all will be well. Okay. And we have karma. So there's someone getting that karmic energy. Maybe a situation, um, whether good or bad. This could be good or bad. Karma is something that... What you put out is what you're going to get back. So if you put out bad intentions, you're going to receive some, some kind of bad karma. If you put out good intentions, you're going to receive good karma. 
okay so this could go either way depending on the situation okay and we have time to get out of your comfort zone time to do something different okay we have be aware there's something that you need to be aware of something that needs your attention okay and we have time to start something new okay so there's a new beginning that's unfolding there's something new that's happening so there's some kind of new beginning that will be starting this next 48 hours there's some kind of new beginning okay let's take a look at the tarot let's get a message what is going on for aquarius please the next 48 hours what is going on for aquarius a message for aquarius please the next 48 hours okay strength you're going to be strong and confident the eight of cups that's that release there's something that you're letting go of the nine of wands the nine of pentacles and the moon card wow okay at the bottom we have the page of swords so there could be someone that's spying on you someone who's doing research someone who is very curious about your situation this may also be someone who's sharing their thoughts with you about certain ideas someone who is um, getting some information off of their chest right um but i feel like there there is someone who is very curious about your situation they're thinking about you um let's see we have the strength card and the eight of cups so there's definitely some kind of situation that you are releasing you're walking away from a situation and you're walking away from these empty cups because i feel like the emotions have kind of left you over drained right um i feel like you put enough energy into these cups into these empty cups you put enough energy into these now you just want to focus on something that is tangible something that is reliable and dependable in your life right so i feel like you're walking away from these cups and you're just focusing on what is more important to you and i feel like you're becoming more confident in the situation you may need strength you may need to feel strong okay you may need some kind of courage in this next 48 hours i feel like that's re that's the reason why spirit is pulling out this card for you to show you that you are stronger than you believe when you are releasing this energy right um so i do feel like there is something that you're going to be defending there's something that you're going to be protecting and um standing on some sort of belief you know um but i feel like you're not backing down you're standing up for whatever this is right and you are reaping the rewards of the energy that you're putting into it there's some kind of increase coming and i feel like it's going to be a surprise something is being revealed to you that may have once been been in question but i feel like whatever this situation is if this is some kind of emotional blockage being released is what i'm getting for some of you some kind of emotional blockage being released but i feel like this awareness that you're coming into is revealing a new side a new side of the story right and i feel like this is bringing in a new awareness new abundance new independence that you weren't aware of before right this is something that's going to bring you some kind of longevity some kind of increase some kind of growth that's happening she's reaping her harvest after um she's watched them grow for a while you know 
So I feel like you're going to be reaping your harvest from something that is now being revealed to you. Okay, and I feel like you didn't give up on this. You you waited for this situation. You waited for this to unfold, right? So let's take a look. Let's clarify these cards for Aquarius. Clarify these cards for Aquarius, please. Give me more of a message. Tell me more about this message for the next 48 hours. Tell me more about this message, please. Okay. So yeah, we have the tower. A lot of change is happening. There's something that's going to change. Some kind of very surprising change. Something that you may not be expecting. But I feel like it, it's coming at just the precise time. Right? Um, so and I feel like this is something that may feel very overwhelming at first. But I feel like it's all going to work out. It's all going to be fine. It's just here to take you out of your comfort zone right um i feel like it's going to push you into something different yeah it's going to change your thinking it's going to change your your thinking about a certain situation we have the we have the tower the king of swords at the bottom, we have the Knight of Cups. So right after this tower collapses and crumbles, there's going to be some kind of offer, some kind of understanding that's that's going to be accepted. I feel like it's, it's coming as a very surprising situation. You're not expecting this. You're definitely not expecting this offer that's coming through. This is a total surprise. Uh, this may be an offer of love, some kind of uh, proposal coming in. It may be for, you know, if you're not interested in love, this may be a proposal of some kind of job, some kind of business, some kind of situation that you're interested in. But you're not expecting this proposal, this, this offer that's being brought in. You're not expecting it at all, right? And I feel like you're going to take this information and you're going to take what feels right about this information and you're going to use it um, to further your situation. But I feel like what you don't feel fits into your situation, you're going to leave it behind. You're going to just release it. You're only going to keep the... You're only going to keep the, the information, the ideas, the part of the situation that feels right for you okay so that's very interesting for you Aquarius hmm I get that these this five of cups you're gonna accept the ideas maybe someone is giving you some sort of advice on a situation and it's going to be like a situation you're accepting the fish but spitting out the bones. Have you ever heard that saying? It means that you're only going to accept what is meant for your greatest good. You're not going to accept something that feels ridiculous, right? Um, so you're going to be very choosy on the things that you accept in your life. You're going to you know, really look and be aware. There's going to be something that you're going to let go of, you know. Okay, let's take a look at what the angels have to say. Let's get some angel cards for Aquarius. Let's get a message for Aquarius, please. Okay, so we have a year from now. So this is some kind of timeline. So something about a year from now is going to bring in something better. A year from now, your situation is going to be so much better than it is right now, right? Um, so that's very exciting 
that you know a year from now things are going to be so much better you're going to have some kind of improvement some kind of increase okay so very interesting for you there's going to be some sort of abundance that's going to come in and what did i just say there's going to be some kind of increase and we also have no need to worry right because your situation is improving your situation is getting better there's something better coming okay so let's get some angel guidance for aquarius let's get some angel guidance for aquarius okay we have two okay we have a call to action take charge lead by example walk your talk you know say what you mean mean what you say um walk your talk you know and we also have increased awareness there's some sort of deep connection trust your inner voice so use your intuition in your situation okay use your intuition and listen very clearly if you need to meditate on your situation you know raise your vibration um, but i feel like you're going to get a better understanding a better um, insight of the situation i feel like there's going to be things that are going to be revealed to you that you may not have been aware of in the past okay so beautiful let's get an angel number for Aquarius. What angel number do we have for Aquarius, please? What does Aquarius need to know? And for the next 48 hours. Okay, we have 666 reflection. Okay, so when you allow time for reflection, you allow yourself to see where inner shifts are needed. It is time for you to look at your beliefs and ask, is this serving me or is it time for me to release this? Reflect, refocus, and readjust. Okay? Your affirmation, Aquarius. As I refocus on what serves my highest good, I feel myself shift into my highest self. Okay, so beautiful, some kind of change and transformation. You're going to have and feel an inner awareness of your situation. And I feel like that will be taking you out of your comfort zone because you will be starting something new, right? So beautiful, Aquarius, this is your reading. If this resonates, please like and subscribe. Hit that bell so that you don't miss any uploads. If it doesn't resonate, Aquarius, make sure to take a look at your other placements. They may be resonating more with you at this time. And until your next reading, many blessings to you. Love and light.